Hello, this is Toon Manic, and welcome back to the second episode of Stardew Valley. And um, we've had a nice sleep, and our energy bar has maximised. That's great, because um, it was um, it was very low, we're getting low. And I, uh, I bought a cola for 75 Gs, and uh, it didn't do much. Uh, so, where are we? We are, obviously, in the morning. Oh, we have a message, we have some mail. Let's have a look. What have we got? Let me add it. Let me add it. Let me add the mail. Why aren't you working? Ah, there we go. Uh, hello there. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. For ya, sorry. I've got something for ya. Willy. <laughs> Sounds a bit suspect. Um, okay. Um... But we'll do that sometime. Uh, let's water our water our seeds straight off. Our seedlings as they are now. They're starting to grow. I don't know if I should be standing on them. They kind of wiggle when I stand on them. That can't be good. And I think we only have to water these once a day. Oh, not twice. Two, two splashes of water. And there we go, so I think that's that done. Okay, so let's... Where should we head now? Should we head back into town? He said to head down by the beach, didn't he? Um, so let's let's just check our journal. Ah, to the beach. So that is our mission for today. Someone named Willie invited you to, the, to visit the beach. South of town. He says he has something to give you. Uh, visit the beach, South Tampa, 4 or 5 p.m. I'll tell you what, let's go and do that now. We've watered our plants and um, uh, we could do with doing some foraging, but let's not waste time. Let's get straight down there now. Oh, wow, look at this. We've got a little squirrel running up there, a little woodpecker. This is a good looking game. I really like I, I, I mean, I'm, I like the whole 8 bitty graphic thing, um, but I really do like the. Um, it's really colourful and, and nice, really pleasing on the eye. Oh, I don't think we've spoken to this person before, have we? Come here. It's quite hard to catch people to speak to. Oh, it's the Shane dude again. What? What do you want? Go away! Yeah, whatever, Shane. You're a muppet. He's, he's actually been, he's just come out of the saloon. He's been in there all night. No wonder he's a bit... A bit leery. I've just watered his bin. I don't know why. Right, uh, we've got a map. I think we get that. There we go. And we're here. So I guess we head straight down. Oh, actually, is it that fish shop? I reckon it's going to be there, isn't it? That's where it's going to be. That's Leah's Cottage. That's Geek Farm. Oh, Wizard's Tower? Wow! There's so much to explore here. I like it. That's, oh, we don't know what that is. A tent. Carpenter shop. Ah, that's where Robin lives, okay. Yoja Mart, okay. Two wheeler lane, excellent. Okay, so I, I guess we've got to head down to here. This area, so if we head kind of down and, 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 and across and down again. Let's try that. We shall be further than I've ever been. We are really going on an adventure here. Head down this way. Oh, I don't know if I want to head across here. Ooh. Ah, here we are. This is the right spot. That was a total stroke of luck. This must be Willy. Ahoy there, son. This is Willy. Here he is. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Good stuff. What are we going to do? Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I told a lot of good... I told? I sold a lot of good fish. Brilliant. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. <laughs> so, basically, you're just buying a new rod with your, with your fish sales. But we're doing that well. Okay. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. Brilliant. Thank you, Willie. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Ah. Ooh, 
I like it. You received a bamboo pole. Okay. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Okay. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. You cheeky monkey. I'll also buy I'll also buy anything you catch. Oh nice. If it smells it smells. <laughs> uh that's that's what my old pappy used to say anyway. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm not sure I'm comfortable with this. Okay, so I think that's it from Willy. Who's a bit mad. Right, so we have a bamboo rod. Use this in order to catch a fish. Um, that's great. Surely we're going to need some... Um, some. Oh, that's, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to buy some bait. Have we got any bait? Well, it's a bin full of writhing wiggly worms. It smells something awful. Brilliant. Uh, can I have some? Can I buy them? No, I don't want to fish. I want to buy some... How do I buy stuff in here then? Can I buy stuff in here? Oh yeah, there! It's nice to see young folk moving into the valley. It's not very common these days. Brilliant. But how do I buy bait? Hmm. There's a little pink shrimp being moving around in there. Okay. But how do I buy bait? Miniature model of a frigate, not much use. Okay, maybe you can't. Okay, I'll tell you what, maybe I'm jumping the gun here. Maybe you go out, cast your rod, and then realise you actually need to put some worms on the end of it. Because that's not going to do anything, surely. Ooh, oh, we had a wriggle. What do I have to do, though? Do I... Okay. Try again. Hmm. Okay, I'll try this way. I'm pretty sure we need some bait. I don't think this is going to do anything. Okay. Let's try the shop one more time. If not, I'm going to give up on the fishing for today. Oh. <coughs> Whoops. No, stop fishing. Right, well, I want to buy them. Let me buy them. Ah, here we go. Oh. <laughs> Trout soup. Need fishing supplies, you come to the right place. But you're only going to offer me trout soup. And a bamboo pole I already have. Hmm. This is a bit odd. No, I can't I can't seem to buy that at the minute, and I just keep fishing the guy. So let's head Oh, out of there. At least I worked out how to buy stuff. Let's head out of here. Oh, we've got a lot here. Let's go and have a look. Oh, look, you can fish anywhere. Oh, this could be fun. Oh, wow. Great big long jetty. Let's go Let's fire out one more go. Hit. Yes. Oh, 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 what do I have to do? What do I have to do? Click to raise the bar. Lower the bar. Keep the bar behind the fish. Ah, okay, I've got it. Okay, I think I've got it. Whoa. Oh, okay, I've got to keep it over the... Ah, I see. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. Well, that's quite tricky. Hey, I think we've got it. Yes! Nice! Wine sardine. <laughs> oh, well, he seems pleased with it. I'm pleased with it. Okay, let's go see how much a fish is. Or can I eat it? Can I eat a fish? I can! Well, I keep it then. Let's go and sell it. I 
nice if I can. It's a bin full of rock. I know. Ah, here we go. So I can sell my fish. 40 G's. Ah, that's not bad. Brilliant. Right. So that's how the fish. Oh. <laughs> In and out of a menu a million times. Let's go. Right. I'm pretty pleased with that. I like that. That's quite a good little touch. So how do I get. Oh, 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 oh. Tell you what, we could forage here. Uh, an axe, what? No. Can we forage? No. Axe, no. No. Maybe we can't. I thought we might be able to. No. Maybe not. Can't go down that way. That's blocking my way. What's this? Can we do anything with that? Nope, it's just a decoration. Alright. All excited there, and it turned out to be nothing. Oh, what's this? Shell. Surely I can collect the shell. Yay, I can. A clam, even. Even better. Yay! Ooh, broken bridge. Hmm, with 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed. Okay, so I've got to collect wood to fix that. That would make me a hero, I'm sure. It's locked. Only Elliot's friends can enter uninvited. Okay. Ah, ooh, ooh, who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Elliot! Ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting, and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. Great. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. And you, sir. And you. Right. I am... I have noticed that the sound effects are a little bit high. So let's just turn them down a little touch. That's better. I like the sound effects, but they're just kind of drowning me out. We can't have that. Right. So I need 300 pieces of wood. I've got 23 there. So I need to remember that. And... When I have 300 pieces of wood, I need to bring them back in this direction. Uh, right, what have we got now? What have we got here? We've still not really finished introducing ourselves to people. Oh, we're in somebody's house. Mm, this is a bit weird. Let's hope we don't get caught. A traditional tea setting. The mayor must be pretty serious about tea. <laughs> okay. Ah, there we go. It's the mayor's fridge. It's mostly full of milk and iced tea. Mayor's oven. Could use good cleaning. Okay. Good stuff. Let's uh, go in here. You're not good enough friends with Lewis to enter his bedroom. That makes sense. Oh, there was a book up there. I wonder if that's any use. Let's go and have a quick look. It's a ledger full of Pelican Town data. You can't really understand it. Well, give me a try. I might. You don't know that for certain. Right, I better not nick his flowers. That's quite rude. Ah, who's this? Who's this? Who's... Ah, this is Lewis. Should we talk to Lewis? Come here, come here, come here. Quite hard to talk to people, especially when they're walking. Uh, so, how was your first night in the old cottage? Fine. You don't get to answer. Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that house. He did. You're right. Okay, I'll leave you to it, Lewis. You're not. Oh, it's some. Um... Oh, it's Vincent. <laughs> uh, sorry, Mum wouldn't let me have any more gummies today. Oh no. More offspring of the village. Okay. Hi. Hi, Jazz. And who's this one? Ah. Oh really hard to get people to talk to them sometimes. Come here. Okay, I'm going to give up on that. Oh, is this? This is a new person. Oh, is that, uh, is that Elliot? He, he had very long hair. Oh, somebody doesn't want to talk. Okay, I'm guessing that was Elliot. So, one thing we haven't found yet, we haven't found the shop. There is a shop somewhere. Closed until summer. This looks like a barbecuing area kind of thing. 
What have we got here? There's so much to explore. Oh, what's this? Hello there, welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological Office. Okay. Ah, oh, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. Don't have any artifacts for display. Oh, Gunther. Bad days, mate. Bad days. But I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Okay, right. So that's going to be... Because there is a mining aspect to this. What's this? There's a book missing here. Okay. That's kind of floating in the air there, isn't it? Okay. So that's an interesting little twist. There's a book missing here. Lots of books missing, but there's lots of books there. Let's not let's not be so negative. Let's focus on the positives here. What have we got here? A load of empty shelves. So this must be where all your finds will be displayed in the end, I'm guessing. Oh, nice warm fire. Lovely. And so let's head down here. Down here. And there's nothing there. So I guess this fills up with all the artifacts you find. That's that's quite cool. That was a surprise. It's not something I expected, so it was like that in the game. Right, so that's that. Right, let's head to our map and see where we are. Wow, we're right the way down there. What have we got here? Ah, let's head up to that shop and just see what we can buy from there. Can we, can we sneak around this way? Tell you what, I should have my scythe in my hand. See if I can... No, you can't nick other people's stuff. Ooh, what's this? Out of order. Oh, that's a shame. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Uh, hi, I'm Clint. I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. Good stuff, Clint. It's locked. Oh, <laughs> great. Oh, it is getting late in the day. I'm not sure I'm going to have time to get to this shop. It's going to be shut, isn't it? It is going to be shut. Oh, it's not. It's open. Join us, thrive. Welcome to Georgia Mart. How are you doing today? This is Morris. That's how I think Morris speaks. I don't believe we've met. I'm Morris Georgia, customer satisfaction representative. When you decide you want to become a Georgia member, I'll be delighted to help make your transition to Georgia's experience. No, thank you. I've just escaped you, you freak. Is this? Who's this lady? Hello, lady. We got to talk to me, lady. Lady, talk to me. Lady. Lady's not talking to me. Okay, so we can actually buy stuff. We can buy gummies. Can we buy gummies? No. We can scythe them. Hmm. Okay, it's 8 p.m. I better head back to bed because it, it kind of appears like your, your energy depends on it. Can we actually buy anything in here? Georgia diet. Low-fat beans in a sweet sugar sauce. <laughs> so they're taking the fat out and add it in sugar. Nice. That's what they do. Okay. Well, I don't seem to be able to do much here. Uh, so let's head out for now. Right, I must head back and sleep. So let's hit that and so I'm virtually going a straight line across here. So I'll just keep heading across to the left. And I'll forget. In fact, oh no, I won't. Oh, what have we got here? It's locked. Uh, yeah, but you can tell me what it is. Okay, maybe not. Didn't do any foraging today, really, did I? Hmm, it's a shame. This is late. We're late to bed. Okay, so in that, this will be at the end of this episode. So I um I must remember to do some foraging next time. So let's head to bed. Hey, excellent. And one thing I forgot, to, oh, I didn't do on the first episode was when you should go to sleep for the night, you get a summary of what you've done that day. Um, although I didn't do any foraging, oh, 
I didn't get it this time. Uh, probably because I didn't do any foraging. So let's pause that for a sec. Um, yeah, so at the, at the end of the first episode, uh, when I went to bed, because I'd done some foraging and I'd, I'd left them in the box outside, I got a, a summary of, of what I'd uh, received. And I received a bit of money from Lewis, as promised. Um, so we, we'll see that in a future episode. Probably the next one, because I plan to do a bit of foraging then, uh, as we didn't do any this time. So, I have been too manic for the goon and geek, and... We're going to say goodbye from Geek Farm. If you give us a like and a subscribe, all the usual begging and pleading. Um, and give us a follow on Twitter, which is at Goon and Geek. And we will be happy to say hello if you say hello to us. That would be wonderful. Um, and I hope to see you for the next episode. Thank you and goodbye. <laughs>